Hi, I'm Tom Stewart for Cleaning Business Today. For today's KPI tip, we're going to talk about customer retention rate. Anybody that's been in the cleaning business for a while will tell you that it's easier to retain an existing client than it is to go out and try to find a new one. We're going to build an Excel spreadsheet today that shows you how to measure your success in retaining customers on a month-to-month -month basis. We're going to start in our spreadsheet by plugging in the number of customers that, that we have at the beginning of the month. For our example here, we're going to say 100. Our first category of backing out clients from that is going to be what we call uncontrollable losses. For our purposes, we're going to call an uncontrollable loss either death or moving. There are other reasons that people leave uh, your service and for your purposes you might want to be a little more generous than that, but I like to uh, challenge our staff with the idea that if they didn't die and if they didn't move, then there could have been something that we could have done to, to keep them on the schedule. So if I back out one from the 100, I'll just do the math here and take 100 and subtract 1, that gives me 99. Now, for controllable losses, that could be anywhere from um, I just don't like your service to we're going to clean ourselves to, you know, I lost my job. The excuses go on and on and on. But for this example, we're going to say three customers over the course of that month that, that we lost for controllable reasons. Okay, we're going to calculate first a percent loss total, which is the three divided by 90 which gives us 3% loss rate. So the retention rate is basically 1 minus that number. So I'm going to take the 3% and subtract, or take 1 and subtract that number from it, which gives us 97%. So for this particular month, we had a 97% retention rate. If you're able to keep that number up close to 100 on a month-in, month-out basis, with 100 being perfect, you're in pretty good shape and you're, you're almost certain to be growing your business on a month-to-month -month basis. I hope you find this KPI tip helpful. Thank you for watching Cleaning Business Today.